Oh my God. Hello humans and non-humans alike. This is the doctor. Ah, oh, son of a... I just watched the Ghostbusters trailer. And if you go and watch it, you're gonna see that fans are pissed off. And, well, we're pissed off because I'm also a fan. I grew up with this movie. And I can already tell you, I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna go watch it. Now, before you social justice warriors go down in the comments and write, yeah, you don't like them having four women taking the part. No, no, no. I don't, I don't care about that. To be honest, I would, I would love seeing that. I would love seeing like four badass nerdy women that to play the part. That would be awesome to me. My problem is with this. I mean, the slaps. I saw the trailer is basically just slapstick humor. That that's all it is, and that's not what made Ghostbusters, Ghostbusters. You know, yeah, sure, it had some some slapstick humor in it, but not enough to make a whole trailer about it. I mean, you know, maybe I'm wrong. Maybe maybe, maybe the movie isn't just that, but maybe, you know, maybe they took all the slapstick humor and they put it in that one trailer. You know, maybe they're gonna come out with a more serious trailer. But let's be honest, the chances of that happening are close to zero. I mean, this is not what made Ghostbusters Ghostbusters. Ghostbusters, well, sure, it had that kind of humor. It had some more serious humor. It even had scary moments, serious moments. This, this, this is like more something like you, something that you would see on uh, Saturday Night Live or Dave Chappelle. It would it if it wasn't if it wasn't that setting it would work great that would be awesome, but not in a Ghostbusters movie. I mean when I when I watched this to be honest the first time I watched it I thought it was a parody. And that I I didn't want to believe it I thought nah this is a parody they're joking, and then I saw people making videos about it. I went back and watched it again and yeah that that is the trailer. I can already tell you this movie is going either is going to draw in a whole new audience like kids that really don't know much about Ghostbusters but people my age and older and that know what Ghostbusters was all about we already know we're, we're not gonna like this because that that's that's not the humor that should be in a Ghostbusters movie I mean even the cartoon wasn't like that you know, and I don't know if they're going to use animatronics. Well, well, they probably not. They barely use it now in movies. That's also something that made Ghostbusters awesome. That sometimes you could think like, "Whoa, that's that's that thing is actually there." You know. Uh, maybe I'm wrong. Maybe I'm wrong. I hope so. But <laughs> to be honest, I uh, just go back. And watch the original Ghostbusters movie. You know, just go back. If you can't buy the DVD, you can watch it online for free. Go and watch that movie. Then go watch the trailer. And then just tell me what you think. Because I think this movie is dead on arrival. It's gonna flop. What this movie needs is like in the opening Deadpool to come in and just go on a murder spree. You know, perhaps leave the four ladies alone, you know, but show them what... <laughs> I don't know, just... Because I think Deadpool would be a Ghostbusters fan, so... Deadpool! Just invade that movie and do your shit. But that's all I wanted to say, let me know what you think. I'll put a link of the trailer uh, in the description. But I'm disappointed. Very, very disappointed. But take care all, Doctor out.